I'm meteorologist Mark Van So, and on this day in weather history, June 27, 1957, Hurricane Audrey made landfall near the Texas-Louisiana border. Audrey formed as a tropical wave across the Atlantic, where it became a depression in the Caribbean on the 25th. Systems stalled in the Gulf of Mexico and hinted of rapid intensification. Centered 380 miles southeast of Brownsville, Audrey moved very slowly as it quickly intensified into a Category 4 with sustained winds of 145 miles an hour. It continued north-northeasterly before it made landfall ahead of schedule. When Audrey made landfall, people were asleep when it unexpectedly picked up speed and struck the night of the 27th. They had little or no warning. It weakened as it moved over land, but transformed into a powerful extratropical storm. Audrey spawned 23 tornadoes in Mississippi and Alabama as it moved into the Ohio Valley. As it moved north, it dropped heavy rainfall. The entire town of Paris, Illinois was flooded by 10.2 inches of rain. Overall, Audrey caused $147 million in damage at the time and killed over 430. At the time, it was the worst devastation since the Long Island Express in 1938. It remains one of the top 10 most intense landfalling Atlantic hurricanes in U.S. history. I'm Mark Mancuso.